Guys, I just got to the mall. Um, it's so weird right now. I'm trying to be incognito. I'm trying to be incognito. I'm trying to be incognito. But happy 2020. Welcome back to my channel, you guys. Um, I'm trying to not be annoying, but I might be annoying as well. I don't know. I'm just forewarning. I'm on my way to work right now. Oh, yeah. I just said I'm, I'm at work right now. I'm such a liar. 2020 is here. I had some goals. I mean, they're really like, you know, simple goals. But like, come on. You got to have goals when you go into the new year. You can't just go into the new year like... <laughs> You got to know what you want to do, and you got to set a goal for it, and you got to stick to it, and set a time limit, okay? You guys learned this in school. Make goals, set a time limit, all that kind of stuff. It's so easy, okay? But if you're new, my name is Isaac. It's 2020. Follow my YouTube channel. We're going to be back on this. I'm hoping that I get that job at Burberry so that I can have something else to vlog about. I kind of vlog about like the same stuff all the time, but I'm trying to switch it up. 2019, 2018 was definitely a mess. A lot of challenges that we had to face. Um, I'm sure everyone faced their own challenges this year. It's kind of hard, but the big, the best thing, but the best way you can learn from it is picking yourself up from it. So even if you make a lot of mistakes, you fail a lot, you have a lot of setbacks, challenges, as long as you pick yourself up from it and you learn from it, that's the main thing, really. But I definitely want to go further into what I want to actually do, which is definitely get a full-time job that pays high because if you live in Hawaii or if you don't live in Hawaii you need to know that it is very expensive to live here so I need a job that's like over $20 an hour and I hope that that'll be my full-time job and then to still work another job that is still semi somewhat good pay but not overwhelming because I know I'll be so busy but I'm so used to working all the time three jobs all the time every single day 24 7 three to seven days a week 365 days a year I'm working all the time. I'm a hard worker. So first and foremost, get a full-time job so I can be more comfortable. I, don't, I hate working so, 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 so much. Second, we getting, we getting bigger. I, I don't want to, I'm like so white. I used to work out like a lot. I used to work out like four, four, nah, th I'm not going to lie, three, four times a week. That's actually pretty good for me because I don't do that a lot, okay? So to work out a lot more would be amazing. But right now in my life, I don't have the ideal time to. But I do have my own gym. The only thing is, like, we share it. So, like, sometimes there's people in there. I don't want to work out around them, but it's whatever. Maybe they could help me. I don't know. But 2020, you wish, you wish you could clock me on how skinny I am. Actually, I did gain a lot of weight. I'm not going to lie. Working at 7-Eleven, I put on some weight. Your boy got a little thick. She thick or whatever. What is this? I got a little thick. Thick or whatever. Peep the Moncler glasses. I broke the other ones, but they gave me another one, so they're nice. I've never dated a guy that was ugly. I've always dated hot guys. Bless my soul. Even with crooked teeth and acne, I've always dated the hot guys. And that is a fact, okay? I won't go without saying that. Even with my acne, crooked teeth, skinny ass body, I still got the hottest guy. So I'm happy and proud enough to say that. However, just because someone is that good looking doesn't mean they are a good person. Everybody knows this, or everybody should know this. Take notes, you guys. Just because they are good looking doesn't mean they're all that. I've dated a ton of guys that are good looking and that was it. That was it about them. So, going into 2020, I need to put it in myself. Um, no pun intended. I need to, I need to put it in myself that when a hot guy comes around, no, you're not calling the shots. Let it be known right now. If you're even watching this video, no. Don't try and make it seem like just because you're so good looking that you're in control. No, that's all that you have. Yes, it's good. It's something that I like. Obviously, that's why I keep going for guys that are good looking. But you don't call the shots, okay, baby? You may, you don't have a job, okay? You're out, okay? I've been telling myself over and over again. I've dated how many? Oh, my God. It sounds so bad saying this, but saying it out loud, I have to say it out loud. Dating guys that have no job, like, you're out. What? I need a guy that's like... Okay, I need that guy because how are you gonna buy me like good stuff? I'm not saying that I want that kind of stuff I'm not saying that like I'm superficial or like that's the kind of stuff like I only look for but baby Okay for us to You know be in a good relationship. We need to be on the same page. That's just the kind of stuff that I'm looking for I need somebody that's on the same well no actually i don't need somebody that's on the same page as me i don't need someone that's 10 pages back from me i don't need someone that's five pages back from me i need someone that's like a whole nother book a whole nother chapter on their series away from me someone that's doing much better than me so that i can learn from them because that's what you do when you go into relationships you learn and you improve yourself that's a dead thing okay a lot of we need to bring that back i've been trying to bring it back forever but so many guys that i've been dating 
are so lost, like they're gone. So it kind of sucks, and someone's watching me right now, but that's what I need to do for 2020, is step into a whole brand new me, because it kind of just sucks when you're kind of just on the same page. You know, first and foremost, I know I, I put some really good goals, but to YouTube a lot more, I, that's another goal that I should be definitely doing more. I have this camera that I spent another thousand dollars on. Mind you, my other one got stolen, my G7X Mark II, that one got stolen, okay? Um, so I had to buy a whole another one, a thousand dollars for another camera so to start vlogging more would make me feel a lot more better um but then again like i say like you can't just vlog and make videos just because like you have to be in the right set of mind that's honestly the right thing like you can't just put out videos just because like you have to honestly be putting out videos because you care and you want to put out good stuff to help people and that's what i want to do so 2020 i'm putting out more videos let me know what you guys want to see which you guys i don't know yeah i try i really do try my best i want to be a better youtuber 2020 okay next i mean it's really simple i'm not trying to make a million and ten goals no no like that's really not it. But you guys should make goals too, whatever it is. Make more money, clean your car more often, get a better job, start being more nicer to people, stop swearing, start eating more healthy, go to the gym more. Like those are common goals. It Just because you have a common goal doesn't mean that it's a bad goal, okay? As long as you have a goal and stick to it, do you. You feel you will feel so accomplished when you accomplish a goal, whether it's small or big. It's a goal, it's something you want to do, you set out to do it and you accomplish it, okay? So set some goals for yourself 2020. You guys, I want to know what they are. I read them down below in the comments follow my social follow me on my social media snapchat twitter instagram follow me your boy your boy's instagram is down below um you guys can always mention me if you guys have questions if you guys need help or if you just guys just want to talk at me up <laughs> hype me up on my instagram i love when you guys do that all those hard eyes and all those fire emojis you guys are amazing i will do it back to you guys um and that's it for this video 2020 i'm back in action i hope you are too stick on that Stay on that same level, be on that same level as me, whatever you guys want to do, be better than me, be worse than me, I don't know. But 2020, I'm 2020, I'm coming for you. Best belief, much more harder, much more stronger, and so are you. See you guys in my next video. Follow me on social media. Bye.